So the Indie World presentation for Nintendo Switch happened today and many Nintendo fans were expecting a Hollow Knight Silk Song. Some kind of news, some kind of release date, some kind of trailer, something and unfortunately we didn't get it. And in this video we're going to be talking about when I think we'll be able to see more information come about the game and hopefully it should be very very soon. But before we get into that make sure you are hitting the subscribe button and also liking the video down below because it does help us out. We're obviously a very very small channel. The more you share out the videos, the more it does support the channel, so thank you for doing that. Okay, so yeah, the Hollow Knight Silk Song uh, is a sequel to Hollow Knight, which is a great game on Nintendo Switch. Basically, this got revealed on uh, the 14th of February 2019. That's almost two years ago now. That's over two years ago now. And many people are wondering when we're actually going to hear more news about it. Everything's been pretty silent uh, from the devs. I believe it's Team Cherry that are making the game. Uh, yeah, everything's been pretty silent ever since that reveal and many Nintendo fans are wondering when we can hear more. What doesn't help is that many Nintendo fans were expecting something in the indie showcase today. Of course we had a massive indie showcase and we did see a lot of things, not a lot of things really interested me that much but the biggest thing I think from the event was for me anyway the Ninja Turtles game that looks really really good but anyway yeah many people are expecting some kind of Hollow Knight reveal and that you know seems kind of you know out there and uh, a bit of a weird prediction but we have to think this is a big indie game for the Switch. This game has been in development since, well, it's been announced since February of 2019. It's been, you know, in development for at least two years. The trailer looked as if, you know, lots of stuff had been done already in the game. You know, the original Hollow Knight has been out for a while now. You know, what is going on? The time is now for us to see something about Hollow Knight. And, you know, there was many different news articles and many, many, many fans were all saying, you know, today's the day we're going to finally hear about it. And I think a lot of fans are disappointed on the fact that we didn't see anything today. And yeah, you know, loads of fans are really expecting this game. They're looking forward to this game. And Hollow Knight Silk Song, or the term Silk Song, was actually trending on Twitter. It's that big. It's it's an indie game, but the game is absolutely huge. And because of it, it was actually trending on Twitter. People were, you know, not kind of demanding, but kind of, you know, confused at why there is no updates on this game. And honestly, you know, it makes sense. You know, it's been two years. It's an indie game. We should be hearing more information about it now. And we just haven't. You know, Team Cherry have been very, very quiet all about Silk Song. And fans are starting to get annoyed by it, and I think, you know, that makes sense. Obviously, I know maybe the game isn't ready, and that's fair enough. I'm not saying rush the game, but I feel like maybe Team Cherry should come out and make a statement and say, you know what, it's not ready, it's not going to be ready for a while, just be patient. I think a statement would go a long way from the devs, because the devs haven't really said anything about the game, and fans are kind of a little bit confused on what's going on, to the point where people are joking about the thing not even existing. If I had to make a prediction, I believe that Nintendo are kind of holding this game back, potentially. Uh, you know, the Switch is the only console to actually get this game on console. It's on PC, it's going to be on Mac. But in terms of console exclusivity, it's only on the Switch. Maybe Nintendo have this game and want to save this game for their big E3 conference that's going to happen in just a couple of months. It would make sense, to be honest. It would really, really make sense because, you know, E3 for Nintendo is a big event, Silk Song's a big game. If Nintendo already have the console exclusivity of the game, it would make sense for them to hold it back to make their presentation seem bigger, seem better. So that's my theory what's going on here. I feel like the game's ready, I feel like the game's been ready for a while, but I feel like Nintendo maybe have something in the works and maybe they have some kind of rights to make them say, okay, we'll, you know, we'll fund your game or something, let's just wait till E3 to reveal that. I don't know, that's a theory of mine, maybe I'm wrong, maybe you'll tell me I'm wrong, but yeah, let me know your thoughts everybody, are you disappointed that we didn't see Silk Song today in the um, indie showcase? I am to be honest, it is a shame we didn't see it, uh, I can't wait for obviously things to come out because people are super excited for it, uh, and my theory is they're holding off till E3, or maybe the game isn't ready, maybe that's just it, but yeah, let me know your thoughts, are you disappointed that we didn't see Silk Song today, do you want to be seeing some Silk Song? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, everybody, and I'll see you in another Nintendo's update. Hopefully, we'll have some more news to share about Silk Song in the near future. But until then, thanks for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow. Make sure you are hitting that subscribe button and liking, because it does really help out the channel. Alright, cheers for watching, everyone.